Marcus McReady, I'm ready for anything! <laughs> Captain Pierre Planks, X Fox the Spot! Major Dash Wildman, love a blooming adventure! Chief Johnny Ladders, it's gonna be a hot one! Doc Samuel Stratus, let's put our minds to it! Imagine next, imagine next, turn on adventure with Imagine Next! Imagine next, imagine next, we are the heroes of Imagine Next! Today, this fantastic castle gets a brand new king. Me, King Angus McReady. Oh, thank you, my fine knights. Oh, thank you. It's a beautiful castle. Nice neighborhood, good schools. I wonder why it was so cheap. What? A dragon? <laughs> huh, that was a close one. Hmm. <clears throat> that might explain the discount. Let's not let a wee dragon spoil our day. Now, let's go find the throne room. <laughs> proper fire safety this time of year, especially with all of this dry grass and dragons. Dragons? That dragon is destroying my castle! As the new king, I need knights who can follow my orders! King? Knights, get that catapult loaded! Dash, you lasso that fire lizard and don't let go! Doc, I might need a hand here. Scientifically speaking, this doesn't seem like a good idea. <laughs> Can we let go now? Chief, soak that dragon so he can't start any more fires! <clears throat> I've got a new plan! I look ridiculous! You look delicious! Now stop complaining and start entertaining! There's a dragon coming for dinner! Now, ready that catapult! When the dragon lands, let that boulder fly! I don't like this plan! Fire! Forget this. I'm out of here! Oh. Yeah! You need to stand still, Lonnie! Stand still and get eaten, you mean? I'm not 
not coming down there. I've had enough of King Angus. Get down here, you big chicken! No way! Barbecued Pierre is off the menu! What? And now an ogre? What's next? Mice? I'll not have it! No! Wait! Fire! Dragon and an ogre in one shot! Angus, I don't think the ogre's all that bad. Maybe he's... understand what's going on. I understand perfectly well what is going on. I am the king! <laughs> I understand everything. I think we've all had enough of your plans. What? This is not how you address your king? This may be your castle, but you're not our king. We are your friends, Mon Ami. And it's about time you stopped shouting orders and started listening to your friends. If that's the way you all feel, then I'm going to have to show you why I'm king around here. <laughs> Attention, you fire-breathing pigeon! King Angus McReady is here to take back his castle! I 
suppose we'd better come up with a plan to save Angus. Indeed, and we need to take care of that dragon, too. That was a lucky shot. Okay, then. Let's put our minds together. The tool was that one. And especially that one. Okay. That tickled. No. That's how we will save Angus. Yes, but how do we stop the dragon? What part of a breath you got? <laughs> breakfast this morning. And that's how we'll stop the dragon. Easy now, big fella. Hey, guys! I'm in trouble here. I really need your help, guys. Please? All you had to do was ask. the castle could do that. Who knew it could do that? Let's wrap this up. <laughs> Come on, fellas. I can't do this all by myself. Give me a hand. Once your knights release the dragon far away from here, it will find a new place to nest. I thank you for saving me. Um, <clears throat> seems I was being a wee bit bossy. A wee bit? Right then. I was being terrible, and I'm very sorry for that. I think you owe someone else an apology. Sir Ogre, um, I apologize for the way I acted. I see now that I was too quick to treat you as a beast. I misjudged you. And I would not listen to my friends when they knew better. <laughs> and I also want to apologize for launching you out of that catapult. <laughs> And for locking you out of your castle, mm. and putting holes in your walls, yeah. and waking you up, mm. and messing up your courtyard. Uh, don't worry, we're gonna fix it all. Mm. Uh, oh, but you know, it was really one of the knights that ate the food that was in your refrigerator. I had nothing to do.
Anyone? Get me out of this chicken suit. Fuck.